When you click the thumbnail, you probably thought there's no way that on foot is going to look so good. And I'm sorry to tell you, that wasn't clickbait. Standard Jordan 1 box, this is Jordan 1 Light Smoke Grey. So there it is, the Jordan 1 Light Smoke Grey. Hope you guys enjoyed that cinematic little B-roll piece. We love bringing you these cinematic pieces. So make sure to smash that like button because it takes us quite a bit of time to create this type of sneaker content. Firstly, I wanna send a massive shout out to Shesha for getting me this pair for early review so I can show you guys what it looks like. I will drop a link in the description below so you can head over to the Shesha website and obviously purchase online and have a look at the apparel and sneakers that Cheshire sells. Now, the Jordan 1 Light Smoke Grey, the poor man's union, as everyone's calling it on social media. And to be quite honest, this is definitely not a poor man's union. To be quite honest, it's the furthest thing from a Jordan 1 union, besides for the fact that you've got a little bit of suede and the red wings tab coming up the side. Um, other than that, no, it doesn't, it's, it's not exactly a Jordan 1 union, so I don't know why people are calling it. But what I can say, this Jordan 1 is not an all out there Jordan 1. Lately we've seen a lot of vibrant colors, a lot of over the top Jordan 1s, and the sneaker community absolutely loves it. I love it too. And then a Jordan 1 like this comes along, and it's just pure, classy, stylish, simple, goes with everything. Now let's get into the quality of the shoe. You have a black Jordan 1 undersole with a white midsole, perfect to wear. As I always say, if there's a black outsole, they don't get so dirty, and the white midsole's pretty easy to clean. You have your white stitching across the midsole, and then going up into this unbelievably perfect gray suede. Now the suede feels insanely good. Hands down, this is some of the best suede that you felt on a Jordan 1 in a long time. However, it's not that plush leather that you used to. It's a very high quality leather. It's a little bit more stiff than others, but very similar to the leather that you often find on Jordan 1 mids. On your white leather, you have a white stitching, and on your gray suede, you have this gray stitching to kind of blend in. And then you have your black heel collar on the outside and that's also in suede, similar to the Unions. Coming down, that same black suede has actually been utilized in the Nike Swoosh, which looks pretty awesome. It's a little bit different from the normal shiny, leathery Nike Swoosh that you get. And then you have your red wings tab with a black Air Jordan wings logo. Coming down into the back over here, you have that red leather tab with a white stitching that actually runs over it. So from the back, these do look pretty cool. Then you have your black laces. The Light Smoke Grey does come with a set of white laces. Now to be quite honest, it doesn't look as good with white laces. I was considering lacing these up with red laces just to make it a little bit more epic. So let me know in the comments below if you think I should lace these up with some red laces. If the votes are yes, I'll post the images on my IG. There it is. Then you have your typical white Jordan 1 synthetic tongue with a Nike Air tab. And that's it. There's really not too much to this Jordan 1, but that's what makes it such a clean cut Jordan 1. And to be quite honest, I think they're gonna sell out immediately. To be quite honest, I think they're gonna sell out immediately. Make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell, and we'll see you on the next upload. So wherever you are in the world, have a good day, good evening, good night, goodbye.